It's springtime and we northerners have to emerge from our hibernation. Put down whatever high fat vegetable free product we've been stuffing in our faces to overcome seasonal depression and take a look around us. And it's not pretty. I'm not talking about the pallid, sun-starved faces and the extra 10 pounds we put on underneath our parkas. I'm saying when the snow melts and we look at the city around us, we see an infrastructure on the edge of failure. We see potholes big enough to fish in and the rest of this looks like a set for a zombie apocalypse movie. Make no mistake, a wave is coming. A wave of aging pipes, deteriorating buildings and failing bridges. And it's all our grandparents' fault. Those big band loving crazies built all this in a frenzy 50 years ago and we've been taking it for granted ever since. That was greenfield construction. You dug up a field, you put pipes in it, you poured concrete over top, it was rock solid. Now it's like we're on top of a Jenga tower and it's deteriorating underneath us and anything could pull out and fall at any moment. And if we ever try to replace it, it's gonna cost twice as much and take twice as long as it did to build it in the first place. If it was just me, I'd take a run for it. I'd head up to my cottage, I got solar power, I'd buy a lifetime supply of craft dinner, but I don't have enough bowls for everybody. So we're gonna have to solve this. And we won't solve it by throwing paper bags full of money at any project with the word infrastructure in it. We have to do better than that. We have to plan smarter. And we have to change our paradigm. We have to think about the long term. We have to stop thinking about the news cycle and the sound bite. We have to think about the asset life cycle. We have to plan for the next 100 years. We have to balance risk and cost. We have to determine what a sustainable level of service really means. The math isn't that complex. We haven't been investing intelligently and we've been burning through our inheritance faster than a rich kid in a Prada outlet mall. We have to change, we have to plan better. If we don't, we're gonna see our infrastructure value melt around us faster than the last bit of snow on a spring day.